Whoa, 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 it's magic! Time for our magical mask! Math is magical. Math is everywhere. Now our special number was the number, can you remember? Five. Can you count to five with your fingers? One, two, three, four, five. Again, one, two, three, four, five. Can you count backwards? Five, four, three, two, one. Do that again backwards. Five, four, three, two, one. Forwards. One, two, three, four, five. When you count forwards, you're getting more. When you count backwards, you're getting less or fewer. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Now that's our number five. I'm going to hide it in amongst our number cards and it's gone. When you see the number five, I want you to say this. Five, there it is. Five, there it is. Five, there it is. Five, there it is. Are you ready? Ding, ding, ding. Let's go for it. It's time to play. Say what you see. Say what you see. Say what you see. If you see it, say it. Stop. Ready. Point. Point with your Peter. Point your fingers and say the numbers that you see. And remember, when you see five, five, there it is. Five, there it is. Stop. Ready. Point. Six. One. Nine. Ten. Three, four, two, eight, five, five, there it is, five, there it is, five, there it is, five, there it is, stop, ready, point, zero, zero means nothing, nothing at all, seven, Back to number six. Well done. Okay, now I've made this, and it's just out of a piece of cardboard. This is called a five frame. Why is it called a five frame? Have a little think. Why do you think it's called a five frame? It's called a five frame because there's five spaces. Let's check. One, two, three, four, five. Again. One, two, three, four, five. There's five spaces. And you can count objects onto your five frame. One, two, three, four, five. Let's check by touch counting. One, two, three, four, five. Is the five frame full? Yes, it is full. And it is full because each space has one item in it. And if you look at it straight away, some of you can instantly say, yes, there are five baby bell cheese because the five frame is full. If I did this, how many baby bell cheese are there? Four, there are four baby bell cheese. Is the five frame full? No, it's not full because there's a space right here. If I move them like this, are there still four baby bell cheese? Yes, there are four baby bell cheese. I've just moved these two and I've left a space. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. You can practice that at home. You can make, if you've got a cardboard box, get your parents to help you cut out a piece of the cardboard and then divide it up into five sections for your five frame. Right, I'm going to count and I'm going to put five baby bell cheese on the five frame. There we go. Five baby bell cheese. Am I right or am I wrong? What do you think? If you are saying I'm wrong, why am I wrong? Can you tell me why? Tell your mums and dads or brothers or sisters why am I wrong? Why is that not five? Well, it's not five because let's, let's touch count. One, two, three. Oh, I've got three baby bell cheese. But you can look straight away and say, well, Mr. Mac, there's still two spaces here and that's a five frame. If you, were, if you had five baby bell cheese in there, it would be full. There are only one, two, three. How many more baby bell cheese do I need? How many more baby bell cheese do I need to have five?
you can look straight away and see I need two baby bell cheese. So that'll be three, add two equals five. Let's touch count. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to take them off and I want you to have a think. Am I showing you five or not five? Are you ready? Let's go for it. Five or not five? And why? Why is it five or why is it not five? It is not five. I've only got one, two, two baby bell cheese. Now the next question for you, how many more baby bell cheese do I need to make this equal to five? Have a look. Look at the empty spaces, that's a clue. I need one, two, three more baby bell cheese. So that would be two, add three, one, two, three, equals five. Let's touch count, one, two, three, four, five. Another one, let's go for it. Five or not five. It is not five, and why is it not five? It's similar to what we just had before, but I've rearranged them a, little, a bit differently. Because we've only got three, look, one, two, three. That's also showing you that one add two equals three, or two add one equals three. How many more baby bell cheese do I need to equal five? Two, one, two, so that would be one, two, three, three, add two, one, two, equals, Five. One, two, three, four, five. Are you ready for the next one? Five or not five. There are five baby bell cheese in my five frame. There are five baby bell cheese in my five frame. Five or not five. Hmm. It is not five because obviously I've only got one. How many baby bell cheese? One baby bell cheese. Let's touch count just to check. One. Oh gosh, that took for ages to count that there, it did. One baby bell cheese. How many more baby bell cheese do I need to equal five? How can we check? What could we do? We could count the empty spaces because this is a five frame and when it's full, it equals the number five. One, two, three, four, five. So we've already got one. How many more do we need? When we put more on, we are adding. What are we doing? We are adding. One, two, three, four. We need four more. Let's check that. One, two, three, four. We need four more baby bell cheese. That'll be one, add four. One, two, three, four equals five. So that was one. Add, how many more am I adding on? Four. One, two, three, four. So that was one, add four more equals five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, let's try one more. Five or not five? What do you think? It is not five because it's a five frame and the five frame's not full. There's still a space. So how many baby bell cheese do I have? I have got four. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. How many more do I need to make this equal to five? How many more baby bell cheese do I need? I need one more. Look, look at the space that's empty. I need one more baby bell cheese and it will equal five. So that's four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four add one equals five. Let's check. One, two, three, four, five. Can you practice that at home? All you need is get a piece of cardboard, a piece of paper, draw, make yourself a five frame. One, two, three, four, five. Once I've got a fish alive. And just get items from around the house and you can practice putting some on. How many more do you need? Ooh, let's count the empty spaces. One, two, three, I need three more. So that's two, add one, two, three, equals five. One, two, three, four, five. Super duper.